Hello everybody, this is Alexandre. I'm so happy to welcome you today on a new video. So like I've said, each week, each Sunday, you're going to have a new, fresh video that concerns the, the, the Le Normand Oracle, okay? So I'm doing this video both in English but also in French so that everybody can follow along and progress and, you know, it's a place really to share and to, yeah, to share the love that we have for Le Normand, okay? So before we go into the teaching and then the reading part of the video, I want to talk a little bit about some little changes coming up on the channel. So first, um, on the 31st December of 2017, we were actually 987 subscribers, okay? And then since uh, January the 2nd, we have moved to more than uh, 1,150 subscribers. So the channel is growing and I really, really uh, want to thank you for that. And I really, to, I really invite those who are new, who are watching the video to subscribe now, to support this channel and to really share the love. It's a free channel, there is free information. And what I want is really to share the, my knowledge so that everyone can read the Lenormand with, you know, with fluidity, with, um, with really easily, okay? So this is the first thing. The second thing that I am going to put in the video now are uh, weekly readings, okay? I will pull free, card, free cards, sorry each week and this will give us the general theme or general energy of the week what we can expect to happen what we need to face what we need to heal so it will depend on how the cards come up okay so there will be a free reading part uh, in these weekly uh, videos the third thing is i also want to add Another part, which is uh, the question of the subscribers. So, if you have a question that concerns the learning and the and practicing the Lenormand, you are free to post a question in the comments. And I'm and I had a special notebook where I'm going to place your question there. And each week, I am going to select one question, and I will try my best. To reply to it okay so uh, please don't post uh, no request for free readings just put you know question that will serve everyone for learning for advancement you know no personal stuff and yeah it will be also a sharing part um, in this video okay so in today's video I'm going to talk about a spread which I call the mini tableau or the petit tableau. This is a, a tableau that uses 13 cards. So we shuffle the cards, we cut them, and then we place two rows of five cards and another row, third row of three cards, okay? And I'm going to explain the placement of each of these, uh, of these cards. So we start with the four corners. The four corners is, you know, why the person has asked the question. It will show things that phrase the question and tell us the why, okay? The center line will tell us, uh, will describe the situation, what is happening, what is happening. The second row will tell us the past, you know, what had happened and, what, and this uh, may be impacting the person in his present. And the fourth row will be the issue or, you know, the, the, the future outcome, what will happen. The three cards below, which I call the line of destiny, will check, will reply to the question directly, okay, will reply to us directly. So we're going to take a question, and this question is from Pascaline, and she wants to know if a relationship with Mark 
would work. So let's go to the table and I'm going to uh, pull the cards and you will see how this happens. So we start with the four cards and here we have the heart, the key, the birds and the whip. Okay, so with no doubt we can see here with the key and the heart that Pascaline is in love already. Okay, and that she really wants to be in a relationship. The couple card has come and this is the, the birds. But in the same time the birds can be little things that annoys you. Okay, and the whip reinforces this. So not really, you know, she's asking the question because she is, she is in love, but there is, you know, some kind of tension, some kind of things happening there. Okay, so then we move to uh, the central line that describes the situation. And here we have the woman and we also have the star. Okay, so this tells us that Pascaline has great hope. She really wishes that a relationship can happen with Mark. Maybe she is living in a star, okay? And maybe the star on her head tells her that her dream is too high. She can't reach it, okay? Even if he, she wish, uh, she wish for that to happen, maybe this will not be possible. So let's see further on what the card says, okay? So then the, um, we move to the second column, which is the past, and the past which is impacting on the now situation, and here we have the book and the crossroads, okay? So the book and crossroads can tell many things like a separation. You don't, in no case, you want to see the crossroad in a real relationship question, okay? The, the crossroad will carry them apart, okay? We will split them, we'll split the relationship. And uh, the book is also what is unknown, so there is some kind of unknown information that uh, Pascaline does not, is not aware of, okay? And maybe also that Mark has taken a secret decision and we will see that in a moment. So then we move to the fourth column and we find the, the bear and the child. And this combination of card for me is a small or a new investment, okay? And as we are reading for love, we always pay attention to the context. This is key, no normal. And we see that there is an investment, uh, an emotional or um, a sentimental investment, okay? And again, the card is not telling us that Mark will invest himself with, you know, with Pascaline. Then the line of destiny to answer the question, we have the writer, the letter, and the, uh, the ship. So the ship and writer is always card that tells us that people are going away. Okay, so with, she has in her spread too many cards that shows that he's going away with the crossroad, with the rider, with the, the ship. Okay, so for me it's evident that Mark is moving away. Okay, maybe even with the ship he is moving to a foreign country. Okay. And this may relate to his secret decision that he had made recently in the past. The past is never, you know, a long, uh, long time ago. It's really things that have happened recently that is impacting on the question. And yeah, he's moving away and uh, there is no relationship with Mark for Pascal. The beauty of this spread is that it doesn't only give you an answer clear answer on what is going on. It is also like, you know, give you um, a psychologic reading, you know, you, you can go in the head of the person and know the person is thinking of what. Because many times, if you do many readings, you will see that, uh, particularly in love question, that people ask you questions, but, you know, uh, 
maybe they are thinking that things are happening, but in reality, there is nothing. Like here in this question, I can even tell that Mark is not aware of the feelings that Pascaline have, has, sorry, and that he's moving away and yeah, Pascaline for, for him is not really, you know, a girlfriend or potential lover or whatever, okay? So, you can do these readings and really help people to move forward and from that, Pascaline can decide what she wants to do. Does she want to talk to Mark and reveal her true feelings? Or does she, you know, want to let go and, you know, end the relationship there? So this is Pascaline's decision, okay? We can help her with another reading, okay? She can ask the question, how can I, you know, help in making this happening? Okay, and this is another reading, so we're not going to talk about that, but for now, uh, for our analysis of the card, we have seen that there is no relationship and that he is going away. So welcome on the third part of the uh, weekly videos, which is the free reading, and I've pulled three cards to see the energy of the week and, you know, whatever we need to face. And we have many difficult cards, you can tell. We have met the cross, the mountain, and also the snake, okay? So, these cards are quite difficult, okay? There is obstacle with the mountain, there is burden with the cross, there is toxic toxicity with the snake, you know, people are not honest with you. And um, it's also a combination of cards to tell you that you need to face your fear, okay? If you need to put some order, if you need to get rid of some people who are negative around you, this is the week, this is the time, okay? Uh, the third card is always for me the card of advice, you know, the 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 clear answer, okay? And uh, in a spiritual reading, I will see the snake as, you know, the animal that has the capacity of shedding the old skin and wearing a new one, okay? And this week, this is what is going to happen. You're going to leave your old ways. You're going to leave your, you know, your negative people or negative situation, and you're going to move to a new place, okay? You will put the burden, you will put the enemy, you will put the difficulties away and you are going to really grow. And also the snake as an advice card is telling you to, you know, see things differently and maybe you should use unconventional ways. I'm not encourage, encouraging you to be nasty or to be bad, but maybe it's not the time to be the kind one, okay? You have been kind enough. This is the time to show your hair, you know, and roar and really show people that you can defend yourself and that you can be, you know, someone beautiful, someone wonderful and someone who really can take charge and take her power back. So I hope that this first video in English for 2018 had really uh, pleased you. So don't forget to subscribe, to share the video with your friends, in your Facebook groups, you know, on your social medias. Share it with people who are fan of Le Dormant, okay? I, have, I will have some new things coming up, so stick to this channel. We will have new videos each week, as we were doing on the other channel, but you know, with time and, and things happening, I have changed the channel, so this will be my main basic one where I will be posting you know everything about Le Normand, okay? The other channel I will post you know things about other oracles maybe uh, because I have been learning some new oracle skills, okay? I'm working with some few decks, traditional old and things that you don't see everywhere and every day. 
So I'm mastering this in my free time and with my clients. And I will be sharing that on, on the other channel, okay? So if you're not a subscriber there, subscribe, okay? So that YouTube can not notify you when there is something new, okay? So for my new book coming up uh, this spring, there is only three months, four months to go, I'm very excited. You can pre-order them on Amazon. You can pre-order them also on Barnes and Nobles and uh, with Shiva Publish Publishing, sorry, with themselves. So I will leave everything in the description box below so you can pre-order the book, also the deck. Wonderful. This is what you were seeing there. It's the official um, banner for my book, okay, that will be available soon, okay? So take care, friends, and we will talk to you next week, and enjoy your week. Bye.